What is going on, everybody? Princess Manny4 here. Welcome back to Let's Play Soul Calibur 6. We're on to Yoshimitsu, another character I don't know how to play, and as I recall, has a has a move that makes you basically commit suicide if you use it because it like takes off like a million health every time you use it. So, ah, this should be fun. I often murder myself as Yoshimitsu all the time. The Manchi Clan. A group of Japanese ninjas known for their unusual powers maintained neutrality even as their country was embroiled in civil war. Fearing their strength and their defiance, the nation's chief warlord ordered every man, woman, and child be killed. However, one survived, Yoshimitsu, next in line to succeed the chief and a master swordsman. He single-handedly took on the warlord's army dealing them a hard blow, but they eventually overwhelmed him, severing his right arm. Despite the countless pursuers sent after Yoshimitsu, he vanished without a trace. That is until one day, an agent for the warlord received word that Yoshimitsu had been sighted. It was in this vicinity, sir. He lurks around here, you say? You're sure of that? Yes, sir. He matches the description. He even had a mechanical arm. So, he escapes deep into these mountains. Finally, good tidings for our lord. Finally, a Japanese voice actor for the Japanese fucking characters. Huh? He did not escape. He just wished to converse with you. Tonight! A demon runs wild. What are you? Are you some kind of monster? It has been a while since I've met such lowly dogs. Is that really you, Yoshimitsu? Why do you look like that? My hate for you all has transformed me into a demon. Now it is my turn to ask questions. They are about the soul edge you seek. You, you will get nothing from me. Is I, Yoshimitsu the second. Not sure why he's the second. Maybe it's because of reasons. Battle one. Fight from dawn. No. 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 How is this? How is this? How is this? Let's do the door knocker. Oh, this is a talkie character. Literally fucking Shang Tsung here. Guys, how is this? Blocked it, that's bullshit. Direct idiot. Gaze upon yourself in my blade and recall what you can about Soul Edge. But know this, you cannot lie to a Manchi. <laughs> Manchi? Mind reading? <laughs> ah! <laughs> so it is as the rumors say. Soul Edge 
is indeed an invincible sword. You appear to have searched for it far and wide, but now that task shall lie with me. And then, with that power, I shall teach you fiends the meaning of hell on earth. Damn. He's real mad about it. Like, real mad about it. Like, he's really upset. Very upset, he's spaghetti. Yoshimitsu 2. Rumors of Soul Edge. Hearing rumors that Soul Edge was sold in an auction. Doubt that. Yoshimitsu headed to the Southeast Asian port. Once there, however, his plans to steal the store were thwarted by a man wielding a strange weapon conceived. There was some sort of pot afoot. Plan to visit the auction's organizer. Tell me what you know about that sword. Look at my blade. The sword was a fake designed to dry out and kill my lady's companion. Oh, this is the Mitsurugi thing from like forever ago. Enough. Or not Mitsuru, you fucking Maxi, the other one. Yeah, that one. So you are the one who spread the rumors. <laughs> Tell me everything you know about the real Soul Edge. Uh, what is this monstrous transformation? Deal with him at once. <laughs> Actually, me. Actually, the longest loading screen of all time. Yeah, get fucked. I am Shang Tsung. Treasure! Let me guide you to hell! The fuck did I just watch? The fuck did I just witness happen on my screen? Wasn't it this move? Yep, that does damage to me. I don't know why that move literally exists at all, but. Fuck! I'm gonna go for the ring out. Can't move, guys. Just, he just can't move. over and over again. Everything I know, but it is all hearsay. Make of it what you will. So the rumors multiply as one heads west? If you doubt me, use that strange power of yours. By the way, are you having money troubles? If so, I have something that might interest you. Do not be absurd. Even as a demon, I'd never strike a bargain with a scoundrel such as you. Get out of my sight. Yoshimitsu 3, The Color of Gallantry. 
Yoshimitsu's pursuit pursued of information relating to Soul Edge still coming from the Ming Empire. It appeared that they were obsessed with the weapon, which they called the Hero's Sword, so much so that the Emperor had dispatched an investigation of units to search for it. Remember with violence and rebellions, the Empire was teetering on the edge of collapse. Perhaps that's why the sword was so desperately sought after. <laughs> that looks like quite a burden, brother. How about hey, brother. How are you doing, brother? This is the sacred sutra of Buddha himself. A full heart fills not one's belly. Buddha, you say? Ha! There are neither demons nor Buddhas in this world. If he's real, let's see him save your life right now! What the? Where'd you come from? <laughs> from hell! From hell, guys. Came from hell. I don't know how I just did what I just did, but it was kind of cool. What? How did I give him health by grabbing him? It really sucks when you can really only play two of the damn character styles in the whole fucking game. Because everything else just kind of sucks. Fucking hell. Going for the fucking ring out. What? What? Just hit him one time, please, for fuck's sake. Christ alive. Thank you kindly for your help. Your swordsmanship and your kindness remind me of a hero from ancient tales. Such nonsense. I merely took pity on one who willingly submits himself to death. Many speak of great intentions, but few are those who act to save others. The feeling of commiseration is the beginning of humanity. Feeling of commiseration, guys. Path. You know nothing of me. The path I walk is strewn with corpses. Though you now walk a different path, your destination may remain the same. I pray your deliverance from doubt is swift. Yeah. Yoshimitsu 4, Seeds of Courage. Once through the Ming Empire, he continued west. Yoshimitsu stopped off in a village in the Middle East to replenish his water supply. There he heard a word from a group of enslaved, strange creatures about abducted people. They too were searching for Soul Edge, so it was said he shouldn't have taken anything with him, and yet, for some reason, he felt like he couldn't ignore it any further. Blah 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 blah. I bet it's gonna be Lizard Man. I bet there's a bunch of Lizard Man down here. You had best leave now. You are the last one. Th thank you. What am I doing? None of this will help me achieve my aim. You! So, you are the one who freed our experiments. Ah, there you are. I have been waiting. Your lizard man knew nothing that could aid me, <sighs> so... <laughs> Same fucking Why, you? shit. Well, over, we have and you over, and over and over Happy and now. over and over Turn and over again. Pieces. 
He shall make an ideal sacrifice to Pelican. Every single story has been exactly the same thing. Fight the lizard men. Fight the cult people. Fight the bandits. Fight the stupid characters. And then there's like one or two fights that is actually against an actual character. And then the story is over. And you've done nothing the entire time. Every single story has been exactly the goddamn same thing. It is so unbelievably boring. Fuck. Like, Soul Calibur, you do not understand how to tell a good story. They, Soul Calibur has never been good for their stories at all. Even in Soul Calibur 2, when it was, like, good, the, the story was just never that good. Soul Calibur 4 was probably the best that they've done in terms of storytelling, because there was actual, you know cutscenes of character development and, and, and stuff that gave a reason as to what was fucking happening. And like the Tower of Souls and shit was badass. I never did it because it was obnoxious. Uh, and I just cheesed the whole goddamn thing because it was hard as hell. Ninja Sock Bear. Guys, Ninja Sock Bear. Let me, let me some ninja sock bear. I killed the man, the best. I can't wait to get another fucking stupid storyboard cutscene with no fucking in interesting anything, and then have another line of dialogue that I have to read that has no fucking bearing on what's happening at all. They call him Nightmare. Oh wow, Nightmare, the character that we've seen a thousand times. is waiting for an opportunity to strike. Final question. Where is this nightmare? In Europe. Ostrine. <laughs> what have you done to me? What? My powers! I have failed! Pelgea! I offer you my body! Death shall be sweet release! <laughs> My blade is clouded by the evil it has absorbed. Have I overused its power? I am just... I'm floored at how bad this is. Yoshimitsu 5. Is revenge the answer? Yoshimitsu made it to Europe, where the rumors of Soul Edge were said to have originated. While searching for Nightmare, the current owner of Soul Edge, he began to feel his mental state deteriorate. So, I, I still don't know what's happening. Doing such cruel. Wherever the Azure Night Nightmare treads, only darkness and the stench of blood remain. His relentless evil makes me sick. My determination to avenge the slaughter of my clan has not faded. But does that not make the Azure Knight and I one and the same? Is this what my clan would want after suffering such bitter deaths? Is my soul now clouded like my sword? No, I cannot allow the flame of vengeance to fade. I cannot. Yoshimitsu 6, in Cursed Lands. Yoshimitsu's long journey finally saw him reach Nightmare's castle in Osrandsburg. However, Nightmare had already been defeated, and Yoshimitsu instead found himself face to face with a young female warrior boasting a power clear and pure. Gee, I wonder if it's Sophidia. The evil aura. It belongs to you, does it not? Did you come here in search of Soul Edge too? Yes. I need to avenge my clan. Young lady, if you know anything about Soul Edge, tell me. You bear a strange power. But it has no effect on me. I am protected by another, 
and by the gods. If it is evil you seek, I shall have no choice but to stop you. So don't grab uh, Sophia, you'll give her health. Oh, fuck. That was funny. What are you doing with your life, Yoshimitsu? Alright, alright, I'll just I'll just be here. Get my ass. Fuck. Fuck! Fuck! Ninja Sock Bear. It's all about that Ninja Sock Bear, guys. All about that. Fuck. Fuck. I forgot. Never mind. It's fine. About to do some ninja sock bear, guys. Dude, I did. I did the ninja sock bear, guys. more to your sword than just anger. There is sadness and confusion. You know how to read minds, too? Even without such power, you can tell much by someone's eyes and their voice. Revenge. Is that what you truly desire? Mm. What is it to you? Can you not answer? I am speaking to your soul. No, not that. Whatever happened just now, not no. Um. Yoshimitsu 7, Clouded Blade, the evil inside Yoshimitsu sword reacted with evil energy of Ross Reinsberg. Its blade transformed into a siphon. Pure malevolence began to eat away at Yoshimitsu's soul. Gee, I can't wait to see the storyboard cutscene of what's about to happen with that! A whole white screen. Oh, I'm going into into fucking fucked up land. Oh, it's evil Yoshimitsu. <laughs> Tonight the demon runs wild again. Yeah. Hmm? Who are you? I am shitty you Yoshimitsu. Wish to know my name? I am the demon of the sword. Hatred is my purpose, and blood sustains me. Hey, yo, guys, I got a great idea. All right, we take Yoshimitsu, we take his picture, we make it purple, and add some flames in the eyes. That's the enemy. That's what we fight. Good job, Johnson. I got it. That's a great idea. Minimal effort. Low, low effort content. I got you. Don't worry about it. You know, we've only had like eight years to develop this fucking game, but it's fine. You know, Mortal Kombat 11 could, could do entire... Fucking big ass cutscenes. I should be doing this. I might not doing this. 
Dude, let's do some ninja sock. I fucked it up. I fucked up the ninja sock bear, guys. Grab him. Dead. He's dead as shit. Oh my god, this is so bad. Do some ninja sock bear. You love me some ninja sock bear. I'm gonna steal your soul, me. Evil sword demon. He's gonna ring me out. He's gonna ring me out. I guarantee it he's gonna ring me out. Fuck you. I can't I can't even take this fucking game seriously anymore. There's a there's a reason. I did not do a let's play of the story mode in uh, Soul Calibur 5 because it was just terrible. This is just as bad. I'm gonna kill him with some ninja sock bear. Here we go. I fucked it up. It's fine. He's dead anyway. It's, it's whatever. I win. Woo, yay. Won. The best. I'm so, I feel so accomplished that I did that. I shall grant you what you desire. <sighs> Enough. How does he breathe? You are He's not a demon. The demon of the sword. You have another path open to you. You. Your name is Yoshimitsu. Now be silent. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> Good. You finally come too. Oh, hey, Sophia. Remember how I beat Where your ass I? in a fight like two oh, seconds ago? You. I'm in your debt. Do not reproach yourself. No. I was weak. I lost my way. Only the thought of another's death kept me going. But never did I discern what I was becoming. I must walk the path of benevolence and justice. If I protect the weak and crush evil, none shall ever again walk that wicked path I took. That is how I shall avenge my clan. Because that's how it works. Obviously. My people, watch over me that's as I works. battle for justice. The names of the warriors whose fates were bound to the two swords have been etched into the very fibers of history. Christ alive. Alright, well that is the end of Yoshimitsu's story. Hope you all enjoyed. Please be sure to leave a like and sure to subscribe if you did. I'm gonna end it there. Um, the next episode is Raphael, a character that I can actually play and actually will, you know, have fun with, maybe, possibly. Um, then we've got a bunch of other characters that I don't know how to play, so I eh, kind of know me, but whatever. Anyway, next episode is Raphael. See you guys later. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.